Military technologies have surprised the world ever since their inception. Welcome to our channel. And today, we'll be presenting you with the 15 most advanced military technologies. Number 15. Unmanned Submarine Hunter More and more countries are deploying ultra-quiet submarines that can lurk undetected close to shore. This DARPA project is called the Anti-Submarine Warfare Continuous Trail Unmanned Vessel, or ACTUV, also known as Sea Hunter. It's like a water-based drone that can hunt submarines for months without having anyone to change watches aboard the vessel. Equipped with sonar, radar, and other synthetic vision systems, the ACTUV will be able to move through narrow channels and shipping traffic autonomously. Number 14. Every Ship and Aircraft Carrier While there are plenty of small, uncrewed aerial vehicles already in service, the hitch for using them on the water has been launching and retrieving them in rough seas and on small decks. DARPA's TURN program, or Tactically Exploited Reconnaissance Node, aims to fill that niche with an aircraft that can take off and land on its tail. Twin counter-rotating propellers lift it into the air. Then it switches to horizontal flight to cruise the skies for threats, relaying video, radar, and other images back to the ship. To land, it reverses the process. DARPA plans to build a full-scale demonstrator system. Northrop Grumman is the lead contractor. Number 13. Invisibility from a squid Current camouflage can hide soldiers and their vehicles from human sight, but it's close to useless against even more common infrared vision systems. Scientists at the University of California, Irvine, hope to fix that with what they call invisibility patches, based on structural protein that the common squid, the ones that end up as calamari, use to change the color and reflectivity of their skin. This protein, called reflectin, functions in the same wavelengths as night vision systems, and therein lies its promise. Scaling up this discovery to a useful military application could be many years off, however. Number 12. Satellite Melter A DARPA-funded program with Northrop Grumman and Raytheon is developing a satellite that will be designed to hunt and track an adversary's defense satellite. It'll work by pure physics, reflecting a sunbeam on the enemy's satellite that will for weeks heat up the opposing satellite just enough to make it fall out of orbit and burn up on re-entry into the upper stratosphere. Number 11. Self-Steering Bullets Packed with tiny sensors, the 50 cal bullet under development can change course rapidly in mid-air, potentially giving even a mediocre shooter sniper-like accuracy, with the ability to hit moving targets with ease. DARPA is keeping mum on exactly how the bullet changes its flight path. A competing effort from the Department of Energy's Sandia Labs uses a laser to indicate the target while small fins on the bullet, also 50 caliber, steer it in flight. Both programs are still in testing. Number 10. Laser Cannons. For real! The Navy's testing of its laser weapon system aboard the USS Ponce in the Persian Gulf went swimmingly, and the Navy expects to expand even larger laser weapons aboard ships to protect them from threats, such as small attack boats and drones. One of the many benefits of lasers is that they can repeatedly fire for minimal cost. Number 9. Matrix-like Virtual Reality Training Soldiers have been using video games, simulations, and even VR for combat training for over a decade now. However, the U.S. Army Natick Soldier Research Development and Engineering Center, or NSRDEC, wants to immerse soldiers in entirely virtual environments. Called the Virtual Dome, NSRDEC's project is a concave, wall-sized VR system that projects a 180-degree horizontal, high-resolution virtual field in front of a soldier. The environments can be modeled after real locations, and soldiers can use handheld devices to aim a weapon as well as move and look around. The goal is to provide clinicians and researchers a safe but more realistic way of studying how soldiers behave. Number 8. Robots that repair satellites DARPA's Robotic Servicing of Geosynchronous Satellites, or RSGS, program is developing robotic servicing vehicles, or RSVs, they can be shot into space to repair and maintain satellites remotely. The plan is for DARPA to supply the electronics and work with a commercial partner on the deployment technology. DARPA isn't the only organization working on this concept. 
NASA has initiated its Restore L to create a low-orbit robotic spacecraft capable of refueling and relocating satellites. Restore L was currently set for a test mission sometime in 2019. Number 7. The Virtual Eye An offshoot of DARPA's power efficiency revolution for embedded computer technologies or PERFECT program to create more powerful computer processes, Virtual Eye uses small cameras to create a 3D rendering of a space before a soldier ever goes inside of it. Let's say a group of soldiers is about to enter a room. Instead of sending in a human, they can throw a few small cameras into the room first. The cameras will pick up a 360-degree view of the room and create a rendering that a soldier can walk through using a tablet or a laptop. The rendering will reveal the layout of the room and the location of enemies and traps. Researchers behind the project told Business Insider that the system won't require proprietary cameras or equipment. Number 6. The X-Plane DARPA's Vertical Takeoff and Landing or VTOL experimental airplane, aka the X-Plane, aims to create an aircraft that combines a helicopter's VTOL ability, omnidirectional maneuverability, hovering, and ability to land on most flat surfaces with speed, power, and durability of a plane. The ultimate goal is to create a military aircraft that can achieve a top sustained flight speed of 300 to 400 knots, hover at 75% energy efficiency, and carry loads of at least 40% of the vehicle's project gross weight, 10 to 12,000 pounds. Number 5. Z-Man Wall Climbing Technology Feel free to hum the Spider-Man theme song while you think of this one. Inspired by the way Gecko's feet stick to surfaces for climbing, researchers at the University of Massachusetts have developed a new adhesive they've dubbed Gexkin. Gexkin combines soft elastomers, polyurethane or polydimethylsiloxane or PDMS, with stiff fabrics like carbon fiber and Kevlar to create a pad that can adhere to various surfaces, including glass, and still be quickly released and leave no residue. Gexkin is now the foundation of DARPA's Z-Man project, which is looking to create gloves and other fabrics that would allow soldiers to climb surfaces without any additional climbing gear. Think of the scene of Tom Cruise climbing the glass skyscraper in Mission Impossible Ghost Protocol, and you get the idea. Early testing of the Z-Man system showed that a 16-square-inch sheet of Gexkin could support a static load of 660 pounds while adhering to a vertical glass wall. Number 4. The DECA Arm System Approved by the FDA earlier this year, the DECA Arm System can make multiple simultaneous powered movements. The prosthetic arm is designed to help people with specific injuries perform more complex tasks than they could generally do with a current prosthesis. Number 3. Long Range Acoustic Devices Long Range Acoustic Devices are some of the most terrifying weapons ever created. These are capable of projecting voice commands over a distance of 9 kilometers to inflict grievous bodily pain to anyone within 100 meters of its sound path. LRAD manufacturers are careful to call their products devices rather than weapons for public relations reasons, but in truth, they're killer weapons that should only be reserved for military use. Number 2. Adaptive Camouflage Adaptive camouflage is a system created to mask a military vehicle's infrared signature and shield them from detection by blending in with their surroundings. This renders thermal imaging systems completely obsolete and ensures that vehicles are offered protection when detected. Number 1. Heart Attack Guns Heart attack guns come in the first place of our list as one of the most terrifying weapons possibly developed by the CIA. Instead of bullets, these sadistic weapons are loaded with darts. The darts fired by this soundless gun would theoretically leave a pinprick no larger than a mosquito bite and dissolve almost instantly into the tissues of the body after delivering a payload so poisonous that the target would be almost guaranteed to have a heart attack within moments. That's, of course, why they're called heart attack guns. So, what's your opinion on these extremely advanced military technologies? Let us know in the comments. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to turn on notifications for more great videos like today.